Can I have your attention, please? I think we'd like to get started. So if you all could gather around. My name is Dee DeLalo, and I am uh, the Community Outreach Nurse for the Cancer Care Center at St. Peter's Hospital. But I am also an American Cancer Society Cancer, Cancer Action Network Legislative Ambassador. As you can see behind me here is the American Cancer Society Cancer Action Network Fight Back Express. Almost everyone in the United States has been touched by cancer in one way or another. Fighting the war on cancer is not at the top of the political agenda, but it's up to us as citizens of this country to tell our politicians we want them to do more. If one person can fight cancer, then an entire nation can rise up to defeat it. Only an organized grassroots movement, united and relentless in its motion, can put cancer at the top of the nation's agenda. The American Cancer Society Cancer Action Network nationwide is a grassroots movement, a movement that will give ordinary people extraordinary power to fight back against cancer. Today, the ACS CAN is using their grassroots movement and the a with the ACS CAN Fight Back Express, our vehicle for change. The Fight Back Express is on a six-month, 48-state, 25,000-mile journey, the largest grassroots mobilization campaign ever waged on the issue of cancer. Through Election Day, the Fight Back Express will highlight the crucial role elected officials play in supporting laws and policies that help people fight cancer. Visitors to the ACS CAN Fight Back Express will be able to sign the bus at the end of our program. The ACS CAN <clears throat> unites and empowers cancer patients, survivors, health care providers, and their families. It's a movement that wages and wins campaigns to secure more research, reduce suffering from tobacco by working for a smoke-free nation, expand access to early detection, prevention, and treatment. Through this mo movement, it's educating the public, lawmakers, candidates, and the media. ACS CAN is a movement putting candidates on the record and holding them accountable. ACS CAN thinks it's time for our government to renew its commitment to the war on cancer. Now I'd like to introduce Anthony Marino, Regional Vice President of the American Cancer Society.